What's up card family? Today I have a little different video for you. I'm going to do a break of my own. And I've got these rock cards. These are from 1991. This is an unopened box. And uh, I'm going to open it up and see what's inside. Just got my Skinner's knife here. Got my trusty Mountain Dew. It's early in the morning. And if I'm a little quieter, it's because my uh, kids are all asleep. Wife's at work. And so, uh, so yeah, let's break into this. Now, I, I thought about doing this live. But, number one, the internet's not very good out here. And number two... There's no telling when Little Miss Carly's going to come out and want uh, me to make her breakfast and all that. And This way I can pause it if I need to. So these are from 91, 288 card set. And uh, I know there's some bands I like in here, some of my favorite bands. ACDC, Megadeth. Uh, Alice Cooper, Black Sabbath. So let's see what we get. This is what they look like. Ooh, very shiny. Shiny hologrammy. There you see it says some of the bands. Motley Crue, Testament, Winger, Bon Jovi. I don't know why they stick Bon Jovi in their ACDC Slaughter Warrant. Da da da. Pink Floyd's in there. Cinderella. Another great band. So, yeah. And actually, if I see something I like a lot, you know, try to build this whole set 288 cards. If I see something that catches my eye that I like that looks like it's in good shape, I might send them off to PSA, actually. So, there's the packs. Pretty cool. Let's take them all out of there. All out of the box. So this might be a longer video. This might not interest all of my viewers, but um, I'll try to some interesting commentary in there to make it worth your while. Alright. Three minutes in, I haven't even opened a pack yet. Well, they aren't the easiest to open. Like Pink Floyd on the back. Eddie the Kid. Eddie and the Kid, sorry. Derek Riggs. So this is must be like a sticker. It's pretty sweet though. Okay. Contest card. We got deep purple. John Anderson. What the hell is that? It says YSS or something? Well, I'm not familiar. There's Ace Fraley. So shout out to the MC boys. MC and MP Fox. M&M &M boys. There's another Ace Fraley. Tim Kelly from Slaughter. There we go. Look at that card. That card is sick. It's like uh, Angus and Malcolm and Cliff and Brian. It looks like maybe that's Chris Slade, I think, possibly. There's a Cinderella. Cliff Williams. Ooh. Ooh, I love this card. 
It's fun. This card is awesome. It's Tony Iommi. Love the green tinted card there. Ray Thomas. Not sure who he's from, where he's from. Moody Blues. They really, they stick in some oddball stuff. Junkyard, not familiar with them. These guys from Warrant. And we got a pink Floyd card. So that's pretty cool too. So, so far, I like what I see. Try to speed it up for you. couple packs at a time so let me know what you think if you want to see some more rips like this if you find it interesting or if you're bored as all hell that's a sweet card right there just let me know so we got Vic from Megadeth General Vic Launch that is sweet Man, that is, these are just so cool. Wow. Okay, and then they have these contest cards. Tommy Lee, which actually, I heard that Tommy Lee signs TTM, so I'm going to have to set that aside. Dave Ellison, Megadeth. He's from Minnesota, actually. Richie Sambora. Man, these are really cool. Iron Maiden. I never was a big fan of Iron Maiden. I, I like... I don't... I'm really not a fan of Iggy Pop. Um, I like some of their earlier stuff, but I, I'm just not a fan of uh, Bruce Dickinson era Iron Maiden. I don't know why. There's Warrant. David Bryan. Bon Jovi. Rod Morgenstein of Winger. Guy from Junkyard. So I'll have to look them up. Roger Glover, Deep Purple. Warrant. Look at that card. That's sweet. It's coming out of a big bullet. Angus Young. Rachel Bowen out of Skid Row. Here's a cool one, too. Seasons in the Abyss. A little Slayer action for you. Oops. All right, we got Dave King from Katmandu. Not familiar with them. Uh, Winger. There's Malcolm Young from ACDC. Vince Neal. Rob McKillop from Exodus. Dave Sabo. Chris Sabo's brother. Even sweet with his sweet chest hair. The Moody Blues again. Cozy Powell from Black Sabbath. Must have just been the lean years with the uh, Geezer and Tony and then some fill ins. Testament. It's another ACDC card. Pretty sweet. Got Exodus and Frank Bello from Anthrax. Okay, then we have the Wave Pushhead. Okay. Yeah, Brett Michaels, Richie Sambora. Ryan Baker, look at that one, that one's cool. Dave Mustaine with his long flowing locks. <laughs> what a ladies man. Exodus. There's Jeff Labor from Cinderella. Tommy Aldridge. Dana Strum. Slaughter, there's Motley Crue card, Motley Crue, 
Dan Reed Network. It's not not familiar with that either. Bobby Dahl. Greg Christian. Testament. And another Dave Sabo. I haven't seen any repeats yet. So maybe I'll be able to build the set. Hopefully everybody's having a good day. And hopefully everybody enjoys taking a look at these. I don't expect anybody to um, watch the whole thing, but if you do, that's awesome. Maybe at the end I'll do a recap of some of my favorite cards of the pool. We're already at 11 minutes. Start swinging through these a little bit faster. All right. Charlie, Chris Slade, Chris Slade. There we go. There's the man. Alice Cooper. Anthrax. Joe Lynn Turner. And Winger. Let's take a look at the backs of these cards. You see, they just have a little bit uh, made by a company, Brockham, which I've never heard of. That's a nice card there. Sticker. Rust in peace. Got Vic there. Blake's phone's ringing. Nikki Six. Sebastian Bach. So yeah, some of these bands are uh, kind of head scratchers. You know, even the... Like, here we got Grateful Dead. It's like, really? Grateful Dead doesn't really go with... Uh, and this is an insert set, I believe. The Grateful Dead ones. It doesn't really go with these other guys. Clown, best friend, no idea. <clears throat> Seen that poison card a few times. Anthrax. <clears throat> Marty Friedman. Nice Alice Cooper. Here's a Brian James from the Dan Reed Network. Whatever that is. It's a cool card there, Megadeth. So yeah, these are definitely pretty neat. Tom Kiefer. Cinderella. But yeah, like I said, there's head scratchers in here. There's some really cool bands. Moody Blues is going right next to Anthrax and right next to David Lee Roth. There's a Clown's Best Friend, 
sticker again. There's another sticker that I missed. Freaks from the pink dim think dimension. There's Cliff Williams and Andy Bryan. Okay, Steven Souza, Joey Belladonna, Tim Kelly, Chuck Billy. So this is uh, all the picture of Chuck on the back. Gives their their birthday, what they do in the band, where they're from, a little profile. Stalks the concert stage like a bull in a china shop. Tangier, not familiar with that band. Take that autofocus off. There we go. Or this. I don't know what this is. Is this yet? Yeah. I was thinking this said YSS, but I guess it says yes. See, yes, they don't really belong either, so that's why I was confused. Iron Maiden. You're just saying, hey, these guys are in the realm of rock and roll. Some of them are heavy metal, some of them are friggin' soft rock, like the Moody Blues, some of them are classic rock, like Deep Purple, yes, Ace Fraley, there's that ACDC card again, I love it, there's a Grateful Dead, here's the birth of Vic, Skid Row, Mark Slaughter, here's a nice Tony Iommi. He is, Tony Iommi, in my opinion, is one of the best uh, guitar players ever. And if you don't know, Tony Iommi actually lost uh, half of his finger working at a slaughterhouse in England, and I, I think it was his index finger, index finger and maybe his middle finger, they might have lost the tips of two fingers, and uh, had to make his own prosthetic fingertips, and because of that, had to tune his guitar down to make it easier to play, this is on his his fret hand and uh, kind of consequence consequently gave Black Sabbath their sound and really worked out for them. There's a cool one. Brian Johnson. Sounds like ACDC is going to be doing another album, but I don't know if they'll be able to tour. They're down to pretty much uh, Angus. And Brian will be able to go to the studio, but he won't be able to tour, I don't believe, due to his um, hearing. He, will he could lose his hearing if he continues touring. Warrior Soul. Not familiar with that band either. See, these, these bands I'm not familiar with, I'm going to have to look up, but... Judging from the other bands, it's going to be, you know, what <laughs> are they going to be metal or are they going to be God knows what. I think I'll just do half the box um, because this is going to be, I mean, it's already coming up on 20 minutes, so probably just do half the box and then let me know 
if you're interested in uh, me to keep doing stuff like this here and there. Not going to change the focus of our channel or anything, but it's nice to do different stuff once in a while to branch out a little bit. sticker Steven Sweet Sebastian Bach John Lord Gary Holt Mick Mars there's that Iomi again that I love I'm going to look at them, and if I think one of them is grade-worthy, it's going into PSA. Okay, I got another Vic card sticker. Megadeth. <clears throat> Paul Taylor, Motley Crue. Bon Jovi. Look at that. Nice. See, he doesn't belong in this set, but still damn sweet. Stevie Ray Vaughan. A little SRV action. Kip Winger. David Gilmore. Look at Brian. I'll take him to crap! Sorry for that terrible impression. <laughs> Uh, Chris Slade, Paul Taylor, yes, Cinderella, there's that Tommy Lee again, Iron Maiden, Iggy Pop, I don't understand Iggy Pop, like, uh, if anybody out there likes Iggy Pop, tell me, tell me a song or two to check out, because I just... There's Eddie and the Kid again. I just don't know about Iggy Pop. How he even is popular. It's a sweet Angus Young card. Sisters of Mercy. See, this is another brand I'm not familiar with. But there's Angus holding some cherry bombs. It's a cool card, too. Tom Kiefer. See this? What's this guy? Andrew Eldritch. And I can't read the name of the. Not sure. All right. There's another Rust and Peace sticker. In case you want to enter the contest. It's another Tommy Lee. Sambora, Maiden, Iggy Pop. Junkyard. Yeah, so some of these other bands is um, Warrior Soul and Junkyard and the Dan... Whatever the hell, project, network. If anybody knows of them, you know, let me know if they're any good. There's another cool Angus card. Hanger 18 sticker. A lot of Vic stickers. Good old Reaper Vic. Uh, Salty Dog. Yeah, let me know if anybody has heard of Salty Dog. Junkyard, I've heard of them, but I couldn't tell you anything about them. What's this? Clark Rotondo. I feel like this doesn't belong. <laughs> Style. Heavy third world world rock rhythms. 
Chuck Billy Dan Spitz. I like how they have every card has a has a hologram. Good old Sebastian Bach. Malcolm Young, Dan Spitz, David Lee Roth, Katmandu, let, let me know about them. I'm not familiar with them. <clears throat> There's Iron Maiden sticker. Another ACDC card. Cinderella. Tony Iommi. Moody Blues. Pink Floyd uh, without Roger Waters. Where is where is that Roger? Vocalist David, yeah, yeah. Without Roger Waters, David Gilmore, Nick Mason, and Rick Wright, Rick Wright. So that's silly. Tico Torres and Tangier. Not familiar with them. So, anyways, uh, yeah, sorry for the long video, but hopefully somebody watched it. I got, uh, that was just half of it. I'm not going to do the other half because I don't want to do an hour long video, but Tony Iommi, ACDC, some of these nice uh, Reaper Vic stickers, nice Brian Johnson, Steve Ray Vaughn. So, yeah, definitely trying to find, uh, Two or three of these that I want to send in to PSA and get graded. I did see that there are some already on eBay. So I wouldn't be the first one to get them graded. But uh, anyways, thanks for watching. And we'll see you all next time. Peace. I guess a dab. <laughs>